Hello. 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 The world's student population is more internationally mobile than it has ever been. Now I'm currently in Dunedin, New Zealand. I have come to American University of Brussels, Sheima. More than five million students are now studying away from their own country. Being able to study overseas is a life-changing opportunity for me. Half of them are outside their own region. My country is so far from here. International study builds understanding and experience. But many students face challenges having qualifications from one country recognized in another. Ami was studying for his master's degree in the Democratic Republic of Congo when he fled from a civil war. He was given refugee status in Europe, but his degree was not recognized and he had to go right back to high school level study. I felt it was unfair because uh, I've been to uni. I was doing a master's, yet someone is telling me you need to go back to school. This is not a fair system. I was a full-time student. I had a job. I had children to look after. It took me a total of five years to get where I am now, back to square one. If the university could design a way that a student or refugees coming to this country they could go to university straight away with the qualification they have, that would be much better. What qualifications are recognized in which countries can be unpredictable, so students and graduates face a lot of uncertainty. So at the moment, my degree isn't transferable. I don't have to go through an external examination process, which is quite expensive. I was taking the rest to come here. So I'm just hoping for the best and crossing my fingers that things will work out. UNESCO's Global Convention on the Recognition of Qualifications Concerning Higher Education was adopted in November 2019. It protects the rights of students to have their qualifications evaluated in a way that is fair, transparent and non-discriminatory. It's a powerful tool facilitating the access of individuals around the world to higher education. The convention encourages the exchange of knowledge and is helping students, researchers and teachers gain international experience. I wanted to study internationally because we are living in a world where the major scientific breakthroughs and the major scientific projects are international in nature. Academically, to have like different perspectives, um, it really enhances like the educational experience and the research that's done is more varying, it's di more diverse, which kind of increases what the point of this whole is, right? The pursuit of knowledge. Yeah. Learning from a different culture and from different people, I'm able to bring a new perspective to kind of think outside the box, as well as having people with new backgrounds and new experiences teaching me new things. When I'll be going back to India, I'll be taking with me a lot of experience, scientific research and collaborations. International education can be a bridge when it comes to the understanding between people from various countries. That is where world peace and cooperation can truly be established. Academic mobility is an important foundation on which to build peace and sustainable development in our growing global village.